Boom! Live and direct. Love. It's love that created us. So we shouldn't be shy or scared to even not only talk about it, but to use the power of love. To use the power of love in the direction of good. Creating something that is of upliftment and progress. You know, as soon as you have your uh, your mind set on towards advancement and progress and upliftment, you keep that. Uh, it's like you have a, your ship is a uh, governing. Uh, you navigate. You navigate in that direction. You constantly navigate in that, in that direction, and you never stop. It's always a. Uh, Every day, every day has this growth. I think in each and every day we must find growth. Find a way to grow. Find a way to... Yeah, maybe there's some days you're going to be more quiet than others. Maybe. But in, in general, I think it's all about uh, keeping your mind not busy into distraction, but busy into uh, creating a, a living soul. Creating a living soul, that's what you want. You want to create something living, not something, not an imitation or or something that uh, society, society told you that you should be. No, no very important to define yourself. I'm going to come back often with that message of defining ourselves in this matrix because that's the essence of a, you know, the fount of the system is our silence. Our silence is the fount of the system. So the moment we're going to become a little bit less silent and more uh, voice our voice, the moment we're going to voice our voice more and just come out and do your part. Like, do your part in this article rise. It's an, art, it's an article rise what's happening. Because l'insurrection, uh, the insurrection in our heart, that's what we feel. Someone posted on Facebook to say, to, was someone was posting something on Facebook today saying, "Do you see the change? Do you see the change coming?" I said, "Seeing is one thing. Yeah, I can see the change, but I can also feel it. That's a whole different level. That's a whole different level of things. When you start feeling things, it's very, very different than uh, just seeing things. I can see a lot of stuff." doesn't mean I'm going to feel it if I don't become that thing. You know, if you don't become the fullest of the story, there's good chance you won't uh, feel the, the the change. You have to become it, become the change. Anything that you want to feel, you have to become it. You have to become the fullest of the story towards that uh, that change, that enlightenment that you seek. Very important. Whatever you do, you want to become the fullest of the story. Very, very important. I think that's how we can uh, do some serious damage to Babylon, is if, is, is if you're original, if you're not fake. That's what the society uh, promotes a lot, the fakery. Stuff that are fake and people that are fake. And, you know... We, in our society, we give reward to uh, the evil people. We, we reward the evil people. And we see them on TV all the time. Pumping their chest. We see them pumping their chest on TV. And that's the kind of society we have, you know. The right just one are always uh, put back, put to the back burner. Put to the back burner and we reward the, the, evil, uh, the evil stuff. All the evil stuff we reward it and at the price of righteousness or all the materialism, all the you know, I think that's a lot in our society, a lot of the trauma, a lot of our suffering comes from the material we think we uh, possess. Uh, I don't know, to me it's much more than mat it takes much more than material things to survive. It takes a it takes a strong mind. You know, it's a survival. We need each other for survival also. You know, we need each other for survival. That's very important. 
you know, you're not alone. I'm not alone, and I know that. And I need uh, my brothers and sisters to show upliftment and show uh, show love, just like I'm doing. If we want things to change, I no man is an island. I can yap my mouth until the day I die. Uh, if no one joined the the uh, the uprising, uh, I'm gonna talk for the rest of my life. I don't care. At least it's changing me. It's changing my vibes. It's changing my. Uh, I'm much more uh, vibrant and vital than I was uh, before. Like the change is, uh, the change is enormous, for sure. And I think it's a change that is uh, very beneficial, very beneficial to uh, to change your vibration, to just I don't know, be more. Uh, be more you. Just be more yourself, day by day, day after day. Be more yourself and be more. Uh, become the fullest. More of the more of the fullest of the story as the day goes on. Like, don't stress yourself out with this. Just do your thing. Never mind the bad minds. They're gonna show up for sure. The bad minds and parasite, and uh, they're all gonna show up. That's for sure. But you don't have to put your focus and energy on the bad mind people. You identify them and you move on. You move on, you give them all the love that you can. Give them all the love that you can and move on. You cannot change these people. The mindset, you can, it's, it's very hard to change the mindset of people. You can make them open up their eyes to certain stuff but to change their mindset it's like a uh, mission impossible for me uh, in my mind so i don't i'm not here to change uh, the mindset of people but maybe make them open up their eyes to the greatness that we all have within and that if we do something with that greatness we're gonna impact the world that's what we want we want to impact the world we don't want to be uh, and you see now uh, because of that sacred mission book uh, that's not something i was doing very much before i wasn't thinking about it so much but uh, grounding now i have my shoes off i took my rubber shoes off and i'm barefoot on the ground you know very important feeling the energy of the earth that's what the you know society wants us wants to isolate us isolate us in so many ways even from the current of the earth with our rubber shoes i'm out <laughs>